This is the most despised font in the world, and it was actually made for a dog. Not that dog, but this dog. Yeah, I was curious, so I googled it, and here's what I found out. Comic Sans has been vilified since its conception, so much so that there's quite literally an anti-Comic Sans manifesto. But it wasn't made for everyone. So the story's quite interesting. Back in 1994, Vincent Canaire, the creator, was tasked with creating the font for speech bubbles for a dog that was supposed to be in every Microsoft's home computer. And his logic was, dogs don't talk in Times New Roman. So he created this font inspired by his favorite comics. And the font's just different, and maybe that's why people love it. But that's also the same reason why people love to call it out every time it's used inappropriately, which is all the time. What started as a font for a digital dog is now used for lost dog posters. And love it or hate it, Comic Sans is not going anywhere, sadly.